Oh, hey, it's me, Taiwan Dixon. And I'm making lamb burgers today. Lamb burgers. Don't get me wrong. I love a delicious beef patty with some American cheese, raw onions, potato roll. I love it. Don't get me wrong. I love a, I love a good cheeseburger. What I'm saying is sometimes I'm like, can we switch it up? Can I do something else? Ground lamb. 100% grass fed. These lambs is only eating grass. That's what they's meant to eat. 100% grass fed ground lamb. Mm. Lamb raised with no antibiotic. Antibiotics or added growth stimulants. What I'm saying is this is some good lambs right here. These is well behaved lambs. They never disobeyed their parents. And now they're about to be in a burger. What are you gonna put on your lamb burger? I'm saying lamb, goat, goat, lamb, goat cheese. You see what I'm saying? It's a call and response. Hey, goat cheese. Hey, lamb burger. That's what's happening. We got our goat cheese on our lamb burger. I'm also gonna add some sour cherry jam on there. Thank you, Stonewall Kitchen. I don't know who they are. I usually like, like to mix this up. Add some like olive oil, a little bit of balsamic vinegar, salt, pepper, trying to make it kind of a, I don't know what that is. It sounds like a salad dressing, but uh, essentially it's a dressing that I would dress up some veggies and put on the sandwich. But I'm not doing that today. I'm just gonna go straight. I'm gonna just go straight from the jar on that one. What I am gonna do, I'm gonna dress up my arugula though. I am gonna put a little salt, pepper, olive oil, a little balsamic, very little though, it's a light, very light. I don't want it dripping all over the place, a very light dressing. And then of course, I love I love my potato bread. That's all I'm saying, I'm gonna love, I love my potato rolls. I know you can get fancy, you can get a ciabatta. You can get, a, you can get an onion roll. You can do this, you can do that, but sometimes I'm like, yo, take it easy. Get your potato rolls. That's what we're doing. I'll be back in a second.
It's delicious, okay? The lamb is gamey, the cheese is tangy, the sour jelly is sweet, but then all this richness is cut by this peppery, vinegary arugula. This is really good. You should make it. But of course, things I made for my wife. If my wife is not satisfied, then I am unsatisfied. So I really do hope she likes it. Sweetheart, love of my life, apple of my eye. Can you come taste this? I didn't come in cool and smooth. I like the way you came in today. It was very <laughs> persisticated. Uh, persisticated. <laughs> this is a lamb burger. Mm -hmm. There's goat cheese on it, which is tangy. We have this sweet... Mm -hmm. You got this sour jelly, which is sweet. It's, arugula. It's, yeah, yeah, you know. You like arugula. It's nice so and peppery. What is the red stuff? That's sour jelly. That's a sour cherry preserve mm. jam. Sour cherry jam. That's what it is. That sounds good. Yeah. Right. Get a bite of that one that I didn't bite because I'm going to get back at that later. All right. <laughs> okay. That is so juicy. It's a juicy burger. I have a side. Eh, 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 eh. Ah, Zidi, you like oh, it? Really good. I'm glad you like it. <laughs> you got a saw. No, I don't really like goat cheese that I know you much. Don't. But it's really not overpowering the sandwich. It I actually know. pairs really good with that lamb. I know. I it's delicious. It. Thank you so much. So it's all mine, you said? That's all yours. Success. Victory. I'm happy. When my wife's happy, I'm happy. It's delicious. It's a delicious sandwich. As she says, don't take my word for it. Take the missus. I'm happy. Cool beans. I hope you join me in the next one. The next time I'm going to be making some of that flag as mama and that maga wawa. I don't know what that is. But you'll see. Later, guys. Bye.